Hello everybody, I'm Sozo1 slash msozo 2 here, and today we're going to be talking about the stylish theme for Roblox. Now, as many of you are aware, if you joined back in 2009, this is what the site would generally look like. Suffice to say, this is not completely what it looks like, but it's somewhat remnant of it. It's been matched with the new theme of today. And quite frankly, I think it looks pretty cool. Sure, it's a bit clunky. 2009 for Roblox was a big year for it to start changing. So, this was the first step. Now, many of you are wondering, how the hell did you get the 2009 theme back into Roblox when it's 2016? Simple, my friend. The usage of browser plugin, I have been able to get this theme back. That plugin, it's called Stylish. Now what Stylish does, if you don't know, and you've been living under a rock for the past five years basically, is it allows custom themes to be put on any website that's supported. When I say supported, I mean actual themes have been made for that website. Now, simply put, Stylish is awesome. I'm not saying you should get it, but I'm saying you should get it. Now, the theme we have installed is obviously Roblox 2009. To get this theme, first you must install Stylish. Stylish is supported by Firefox, Chrome, and any other browser that's built on the Chromium base, which is what Chrome uses. Once you get Stylish installed, go to a website you want to. Like, let's say for example, well obviously Roblox for this example. You click on the stylish button and it'll open a little pop-up menu. And you can go scroll down to find more styles for this site. Once you click on that, another web page will open up and userstyles.org will show all the available styles for that website. Now, the handy thing is, it will show you when the style was last updated and how many installs and how many people like it which is very useful. Now, right off the bat there are two themes on the front page that may interest you if you are a classic Roblox lover. If you were from 2008, like me, or 2009, I won't judge 2007, you might be going for the 2009 page, but who am I to judge you might be going for the 2011 page. Personally, I'd go for both, but since I was, I joined back in 2008, I want the 2009 theme. Anyway, but you can install any theme you want. Now some themes are so customizable that they'll allow you to put a custom background image. For example, Roblox is uh, on page, I believe, I can be on the first page. Yes, Roblox Landing allows you to put your own image, either via URL or uploading. And you can turn off page ads, which is always nice, but then again, we're in an age where ad blockers are rampant, so I don't really see the point of that. Maybe it's just that when you click play. Anyway, after you install the theme of choice, you may have to restart your browser or the web page that you've installed for a theme for. Now, for the 2009 theme, anyone who've installed that might notice that the mess, the sidebar messaging is all gone. The chat and party is still there. To access your messages, there's, you can't use this old way anymore as Roblox has changed it so much. Who knows, maybe the theme maker will try to find a way to bypass that. What you have to do for messaging and friends is you have to go to the top left corner and hang on, sometimes it doesn't work properly. There'll be a little thing will slide out that says messages and friends. And that's it. And maybe maybe I'll be asking, hey, I see tickets. Yeah, well that doesn't work either, sadly. They remove tickets and uh, they will come back probably. Now for those of you asking, where's the search bar function? There was a search bar function. Well, that's been moved up to the top. It still works properly. You can search whatever you want. And it works. This is 
the games tab. Now, I'll go ahead and show off the games tab, all the other tabs that are available. So I'll shut up for once and give you a tour. Now, as you can see, it is mostly back to 2009. Obviously, the theme maker has to do some fixing and some general optimizations. But in general, this is basic 2009 theme. Obviously, he can't implement everything that 2009 had. For example, the tickets, because tickets were removed, unfortunately. And one of the, I think it's one of the dumbest moves, but that's my opinion. Now, that's pretty much everything. Uh, so here's your themes. Have fun installing them. Goodbye.